and welcome to Popcorn News. Something to watch while you eat popcorn. You may notice that I am in the shadows. This obviously means I am hiding my identity so that I must really know something to hide my face. Because I hide my face, obviously I don't want the government to come after me. So you can see that I really must know something here because I'm hiding my face. And also, if I had speech synthesis, I could fake my voice. And obviously, if I was faking my voice, then I must really know something. But uh, that's not me to be hiding in the dark. Uh, just... Uh, <coughs> be like that. Just wing it. <laughs> What's the difference? Nobody's watching or anyone. <laughs> but that's not me to, to be hiding in the dark. Uh, there's also a, another little trick I could do to make you really think I oh, he must know something because he is hiding when he says it. The, this trick is to do the record your desktop thing and uh, just speak but uh, hide your face Don't be afraid. Be very afraid. The government is going to get you. Uh, so, so here's a that a little trick I could do, like a lot of people do. Now, here you'll notice that I am speaking, but I am hiding my face because what I'm saying is so deep and so secret that I must hide my face else the government would come and take me away to the FEMA camps. Delta Force agent claims they were abducted by UFO in shock complaint to U.S. military. Uh -huh. I proved human-alien hybrids exist, says scientist who found them living on Earth? Well, they would be grabbing me and taking me away, but ha ha ha, I'm hiding my face. Ha <laughs> ha. What is so horrible about the Large Hadron Collider at CERN in Switzerland? That's what I'm trying to figure out. I keep coming across things about who CERN is doing this and CERN is doing that. But the only thing so far concrete I found is the CERN logo. So the CERN logo, uh, you can detect the number 666 within the CERN logo. Let's see that again. And there's also Tat, uh, founding father of the popcorn news concept. All honor to Tat. All honor to Tat, founding father of the popcorn news concept. You know, Lord have mercy. Where do we start? Let me light this cigarette. I, I need a little coffee too.
looks like this, folks. I seen a video last night about a movie. Well, a series. And in this series, it's pretty much about Tant is often uh, pointing out all kinds of uh, evil things coming from CERN, uh, but I, I can't find anything concrete. Uh, there was this one video that I looked at, and, and the guy is a blithering idiot. It, you know, and he hides his face, too. Oh, of course he does. <laughs> He's a blithering idiot. He would hide his face. So uh, here's a little clip. True Bum Belt here, and today I have so much to share with you. I'm going to be talking with you about CERN and what they're not telling you, as well as some of the other CERNs, because it's not just the CERN in Switzerland. There are many more, as well as some other weather phenomena that have been going on in the past couple of weeks and alone. Was You're way gonna... off the charts. What were they really doing and getting ready for over at CERN? And here's a screenshot I just took of the CERN feed through the back door showing a seven day feed. You can see that at approximately eight to nine PM UTC that the power, the green line in the graph, begins to increase in a long, slow momentum until it reaches its peak at approximately twelve noon on April twenty second. Right so here. Right. And you can see that it's all above the line and you can see it again over there as well and the question is why and what are they not telling us what are they keeping from us here's a close-up of the two-day feed through the back door notice that the green line doesn't drop until afternoon on the 22nd well that's about all there is for now uh, I guess I'll just sign off and uh... Maybe I should be afraid, eh? <laughs>